Season 6 is underway. Let's run some Terror Zones. What's up YouTube? Winterguard here. So we're full into Season 6 and we got the Sork leveled up and through her Hell Difficulty playthrough. So we're going to go ahead and start doing some runs for gear. So for this video, we're going to do a compilation of 100 Terror Zone runs, but not your typical, you know, 100 Chaos or 100 Night or Terror and Ariel. This is just going to be whatever Terror Zones happen to pop up. We're going to be running through some various ones and just seeing what kind of gear we could drop. The gear is not going to be great starting off. We're actually at around 100 Magic Finds, so not a ton. So we're going to go ahead and see what we could pull from these runs to kind of get our our sort geared up and uh, see how it goes so if you enjoy this video give me a like and subscribe and let's get into it
All right, so as you guys can see, we got into a decent amount of gear there. Uh, that was, that was kind of spread across a couple of days of different terror zones. Uh, we did hit a couple of decent ones, but for the most part, they were just random terror zones. What I did come to find, and it doesn't really show in this video, but Tristram has become kind of kind of my favorite this season. We've gotten a decent amount of Sunder Drops from there, and we did pick up one other item that I'll show now. I had a Griffin actually drop in Tristram Terrazon pretty early before I even decided to record this video. But um, yeah, that, that one's starting to climb to the top of my list, or at least my top three or four Terrazons that I like uh, running. But as outside of that, we, used, we did finish strong with the Sir Rune. Uh, that's our first high rune of the season, so I'm I'm pretty happy to see that. Even though, to be perfectly honest, I'm probably not going to do anything with it. I always say I'm going to trade it, trade stuff for other stuff. I end up not doing it, but Sir Rune will probably just sit in my inventory, and we'll just look at it every once in a while. Well, I guess we could get a different uh, another one to potentially cube up to a bird, but unless that happens, I got to be honest, that Sir Rune is probably just going to take up space but we did get an upgrade I was running a 24 resist Viper and we got a 33 so that was a decent upgrade for me and I did take the lowest lightning sunder I got three during those runs which is kind of crazy I gave the other two actually I gave three away I had a 90 that I found early on but obviously it was a 90 so we quickly replaced that one as these these lights under started dropping. I gave the rest away. Um, outside of that, yeah, I got a couple here still I'm holding, but um, those will probably be given away at some point. We're probably going to start diving into maybe doing some key runs now to eventually do our Sunday giveaways for torches, but uh, we're going to go ahead and move into that kind of phase now because obviously I got an Annihilus which I had to get help for declone because I couldn't kill him myself um, and I we need the torch next so we'll probably move into doing some key runs and start uh, doing some torch runs uh, within the community so we'll see how that goes I'm also planning on moving into probably a Javazon at some point and probably my usual I always end up spinning up a barb just to do uh, trav runs and hork in that which is always a good time but um, we'll leave it here for now uh, if you got any ideas on what kind of uh, runs you'd like to see just uh, leave a comment and let me know outside of that if you enjoyed the video give me a like and subscribe uh, if you want to reach out to me you can get uh, the discord link is in the description you can join our community there and um, I stream usually four days a week you can see my schedule in the description as well but i hope you enjoyed it keep on farming